dork. Hey guys, welcome back to Dental Dork. My name is Chrissy and I'm a registered dental hygienist. I wanted to make a quick video on my results of my Osteo Restore or my AGA appliance. So let me clarify, AGA stands for Anterior Guided Growth Appliance and it's the same thing as the Osteo Restore appliance. A little background on those names, I don't exactly know how the AGA aspect came in. I think that was like a nickname that was given to the Osteo Restore appliance. I'm, I'm not exactly sure. But I know Dr. Steve Galella is uh, the man that has the Osteo Restore appliance or the AGA appliance patent. He is the owner of Facial Beauty Institute and has named the actual product an Osteo Restore appliance. There's always big discussion out there whether it's an AGA or an Osteo Restore appliance and the concept behind it is that they don't like to call it an AGA because it's an anterior guided growth appliance. And the mechanism of the appliance is not actually growth. The way that the Osteo Restore or AGA appliance works is by, is going to require a whole nother video, which I will get into, just not yet. Okay, so let's talk about my results. My Facial Beauty Institute report came back and required me to have anywhere between five to seven millimeters of anterior remodeling. And I got an average of six millimeters. So after my AGA appliance came off, I took impressions and directly compared them to the models that I had taken before I was even in the appliance. And we measured from the disto buckle cusp of the first molar on either side of them and measured about three millimeters of transverse or palate increase. And that was really cool. I think that was a huge factor of my myofunctional therapy that I was doing. I focused really, really hard on getting my tongue up on the roof of my mouth and really applying pressure to the more back, more posterior part of my palate. There were two other observations that I made that were really kind of cool. Um, the first was comparing the models my roof of mouth is more shallow now. Before it had a higher vault, and it's not a lot more shallow, but it's definitely changed. The second really cool thing is I actually have a less of a gummy smile. And this was obvious when we looked at the models, I could see where my frenum attachment to my, to my teeth were. It was actually smaller on one to the other. And I actually have noticed just smiling, like looking in the mirror and such. So those were all really kind of cool. I mean, they were pretty brief. I just wanted to come on here and share my results and post some photos of befores and afters. But it's been a pretty cool process and I'm looking forward to getting it done with. questions below and don't forget to click subscribe to see more from your downloads. Have a great day guys!